guys okay i'm back from the supermarket you would have seen some clips of me just gallivanting around the supermarket so i have bought the rest of the things that we need for the month here is our receipt <laughs> so i'm just going to take you through everything that we got they are all right here behind me let me show you guys everything that i got from the open market um this all these here are the stuff that are meant to be in the freezer they are all washed and i put them in ziploc bags for the freezer some of them are labeled others are not i'm going to try and label them um today before i put them back because i need them labeled actually so this is dry fish i put my dry fish in the fridge or freezer because i really don't want it to get bad i don't want the weevils and all of those you know nasty stuff to start running around on the on the fish and then i got um this is more dry fish this is mangala yes that's what it's called so i also wash and put in the freezer um another thing that i got that is in the freezer is oba so this is uba this is used to make abacha so i bought quite a lot of it because i actually enjoy using it to also make a special type of sauce that i think i'll be able to get around to show you guys but it's for yam and it's super delicious so that's why i bought quite a lot of it but you know here you go um i got some beef Buying beef in the market is like extreme sports, but I really didn't want to go to any other market, so that's why I just bought it at Oingo. I also got some pomo. Um, this is some pomo. This is really thick pomo. I really like buying these thick pomo that is like meat. <laughs> I get a lot of value from it. Don't blame me. Don't judge me. Things are tough. This is cow leg. I bought two pieces of cow leg, they cut it up for me in the market and then I came home, washed it and it's in this ziplock bag, this is quite heavy, this is quite a lot. Also, iru stays in the freezer, my iru stays in the freezer, it's cleaned, it's washed, it's in a bag and there you go. What else did I get? And then finally, these shrimps. Oh my god, I even put these shrimps in eggs, guys. If you've not tried that, you should try putting these dried shrimps in eggs. Phenomenal. Um, I use this for soup, banga soup. I just throw a couple of them, more than a couple, in the soup, and it's amazing, it's delicious. Another thing I got from the market is this banga seasoning, this palm fruit extract. This is not seasoning, this is actually the palm food that i use for banga soup because and nobody got time nobody has the time to start you know extracting the actual seeds and all that really i don't have that kind of time in this because i also got pap if you know you know that the women at oil will make wonderful pap so i got this i think this is like 200 and look at it this is a lot Please, Ireland cannot kill me. Ireland will not render me penniless. I got some sugar, I got some salt, I got semolina, this is what I eat. I don't eat semolina, sorry. And I got these for pepper soup and also for uba. This is actually the calabash nutmeg, but it's already deshelled. I don't like stress. This is. Oh, I can't remember what the name of these seeds are, but these are Uziza seeds. So here we go. Because I can't stress. I also got this new box of Ziploc for everything that I needed to use it for today. So I just decided to pick up a new box of Ziploc. Also, I got some stock fish. This is the full body of stock fish. So I got this. I also got the head of the stock fish this head packs a lot of flavor like so much flavor so it's always good to have a mix of both the head and the body in your soup i also got some fruits i got these seedless grapes and i also got some apples from the market i got these peppers these peppers are really hot like they're really hot this is the red pepper and then i got these black peppers for soup so aromatic so nice 
for Nigerian soups, you have to have this. And then to complete my abacha, this is uh, this is the actual abacha. This is the actual abacha. You soak it in some water and you're good to go. And I also got these cheeky cheeky noodles from the market. I got two boxes of cheeky cheeky noodles. Yep. I don't know if anyone else knows, but I think that chiki chiki is the best noodles to actually like jazz up because it ha already has this umami. I don't know, like it already has this foody taste, you know. It has. It doesn't have that typical Indomie taste that when you, when you mix some things with it, it begins to taste weird. But if you are someone that likes to jazz up their noodles a lot. Then you should try jazzing up chicken chicken. You will love it. I'm telling you. Next, I got this big, <laughs> this big sachet of curry powder. I wanted to buy the medium size, but they didn't have it. So I got this. This was about 4,000 naira. It wasn't funny. And the fact that I only use this Ducros brand just made me like get it. This no chicken seasoning cubes. They look like this. This looks like new packaging. Which new promise? I got these at six fifty each, but I I went to I went somewhere else and I got these for six hundred. So that's why I snatched it up. So this is the beef. I use this for jollof. Well, I use this for chicken, for turkey, for fried rice. That's what I use the chicken for. This is my Oingo Market haul. I'm going to start with these. Um, semi salted butter this is from the ambassador brand i actually got two of it and next is this chicken this chicken i got it for 2536 naira and i think that it's so expensive i just think so i don't know how much a kilo of food chicken is in the market right now but this 2536 sounds so expensive so the next thing that i got is this whoopsie is this um shrimp these are fresh shrimps and i got those how much are these how much are these i also got these chicken franks i'm just going to be leaving the prices in the video i got these chicken franks i got two of it and then i got greek yogurt for our granola i got three packs of this i think it's about a thousand naira or so but i'll just leave the cost and then i also got this lz yogurt then i decided to try this out this is Milton samosas i really don't like vegetable samosas or vegetable anything in all these things so i decided to try this Milton samosas out just to see how it is and if i would enjoy so if i enjoy it i'll definitely buy more but i also bought these shrimp spring rolls they are eight inside so value for my money i got um sardines it's like it's like a staple <laughs> it's a staple i also got some oil I got some sachet tomatoes, which I use for my jollof. I don't put um, sachet tomatoes or concentrated tomato paste in my stews. I got a all an all-time favorite of mine from fries. I bought two bags of fries because we go through it pretty quickly. Next thing I got is this vitamin, a pack of six. I like buying a pack of six because if you know this drink, you would know that you can't just stop at one. Like by the time you start enjoying one, it's just finished, so you need to grab another one. So I bought six of these. I also got my Schweppes. I really love taking this. And this is the Shrek Veggie Mojito. I got two packs of that. I got some milk. I got some golden morn. I got mayo and then on to the veggies so i got um cabbage is a whole cabbage and this is 875 naira these are some spring onions for 325 not bad um i got lemons 926 naira for just two lemons i got um some garlic just to supplement the one i already have at home and it was 247 naira 50 cover i got um three cucumbers at 233 naira is that 33 yeah 233.90 for just this three short cucumbers i can't help 
and this pack of peppers these are like these are actually a bang for my buck because i usually would buy one in the open market for 300 naira but i'm getting three at 370 naira so this is actually this makes sense in terms of like my money all right guys so that's all that i got except for um alcohol which i didn't want to like show in this video thank you for supporting my channel by subscribing and liking and watching all my videos i really really appreciate the support if you've not done so already please do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting content and see you in my next video guys bye